We got back from our RV trip today and we just got the RV cleaned. We got all of our stuff put away. I haven't even showered yet. The kids are showered and I had to come pick up our sweet lady. And it's funny, she's so hyper right now. Well, she's calmed down. <laughs> she knows I don't like to be licked. And so she is doing everything in human, po human possibly, dog possibly to not lick me and that's a good girl but I can tell she's just like wanting love don't you worry you know that there's people in this car don't you don't you that is what I was expecting don't pin her down don't pin her down let her be happy <laughs> <laughs> oh, she see, this is what she wanted to do to me, but knew that I would not like it, so. <laughs> Hi. Oh, lots of kisses and licks. Lady, we're happy to see you too. Hi, come here. We're happy to see you too. Do you want to know what the vet said about her? He said that everybody loves Lady and that she is the dream dog to board because she was happy and loves everybody. And they said, this is what they said, they're like, she loves to be held like a baby. Which she does. She likes to be held like a baby. <laughs> I have to let her calm down before we can go. <laughs> oh my gosh. I didn't vlog this part, even though it's my favorite part. So this is what we did. I told the kids as I emptied the RV to the grass, told the kids to bring it to the front door. And then from there, we waited until we were clean to put the rest of the stuff away, um, which is like my favorite part, like sorting the laundry, doing all that. But I did not film that this time. Um, Joel even had the energy to mow the lawn. The flowers bloomed while we were away. So coming home um, felt really, really, really good today. We didn't vlog it, but hi. It's 5.45. Keep in mind the kids have been going to sleep at like midnight. I told the kids they could sleep in the RV since we're taking you home tomorrow. <laughs> this is how I found them. So. snoring. Okay, I guess this is where they're sleeping. Good morning, Bali boys. <laughs> Bali men, please. <laughs> We're men. Good morning, my Bali men. Can I call you that? <laughs> Guys are working this morning. I just got back from working out. Thank you. Hala. And I woke up to my boys unhappy. In fact, they went to bed very unhappy. And I only have two. And I'm looking at them, they're taking a bath. They've got some like fun Play-Doh from uh, Lush, which I will link in the description because it's like such a fun like little Play-Doh set. Anyway, they're taking a bath. I don't want to distract those guys. So I'll come in here. Okay, the boys went to bed so bad. Um, they were like, they fell asleep. Oh, I showed you. Oh, I showed you. <laughs> so they fell asleep and that was at like, I don't remember what time it was. And then they woke up like an hour later. And so I just like, okay, it's time to go back to bed. It's still bedtime. And they're like, but we were gonna sleep in the RV. And I was like, no, it's past that. Like we're not putting a movie on, like it's bedtime. And then that was Boston. And then Lincoln woke up and I was like, did I just hear it? Joe and I were in bed. And I was like, did I hear that? And we were so excited to go to bed early. And Joel was like, I think someone's in the RV. He goes out there. Lincoln is like wandering around the RV with his blanket. He's all crying and upset. Put him back to bed. Then Boston was back up. Next thing we know, Boston's sleeping on our floor. It was wild. So Cody and Olivia went home with cousins and grandmas. So it's just the two of them. And we're gonna hang out this morning. And we're taking a bath and we're gonna watch a movie in the bathtub. Do you guys know how good it feels to get cleaned up after a trip? And to get our footage sorted through and to, I don't know, be back to normal life? Do you know how good that feels? It feels really good to be 
home. Feels good to be home. The best part about being gone though, <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, is coming home to like built up packages because I just get a bajillion packages in the mail. Good, bad, you know, whatever. I wanna show you what I got, but not in too much detail because there's gonna be a reveal video coming out soon. So, I am getting ready to decorate my patio, which I have not done ever. Anyway, if you're interested, I'm not gonna go into detail with these, but if you're interested in the ones that you see in front of you, I'll put them in the description for you. But I'm gonna be doing like a whole like patio reveal video soon. Do you know what I don't love about coming home from vacation is the laundry. I'm not a huge, huge fan of the laundry. So we're gonna lay a few things out here. Basically anything of mine, I lay out to dry. Any of Joel's shirts, I lay out to dry. And some of the kids' clothes, I lay out to dry. Okay, that seems like a little high maintenance, but like cheap clothes, toddler clothes, you can't put in the dryer because then they are short and wide and then they don't fit your kids anymore. And especially like his cute little like camping shirt. Look at his little camping shirt. Oh my gosh. Gotta lay his camping shirt out, but then like I'll just toss the rest of the stuff in the dryer. Hoodies can go in the dryer, but like my boys' t-shirts, I just don't like them to be short and wide. Do you know what I mean? But like some of Joel's shirts can go in the dryer. I basically just lay every single thing out to try. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we got shirts up here. We got our clothes right here. And you, Missy, scared the crap out of me hearing all these little things snapping behind me. I didn't even know you were here. Super naughty. This is naughty, lady. It's naughty. You're the naughtiest. You're the naughtiest. Give me it. Come on, it. I got my day, sneak on my day. What else do you have? Give me, oh, come here. She is the most sweetest little puppy. It. It's so sweetie. I'm sorry you can't have day. I'm sorry you can't have day. Okay, let's get back to the whole package, sitch, because I've got a few other things for you. <laughs> I'm telling you right now that it is not easy to find artificial like plants that look really decent. How cute is that? This is gonna go on the patio on one of those like silver or gray things that you saw downstairs. So super dang cute, we've got that. And then I don't even know what I'm gonna do with these, but there's a little one and there's the mommy one. And then, there's this little guy. Don't ask me guys, sorry, it's, it's, it's a day. Oh, oops. And then a little one of him. These all came from Target, and I'm not exactly sure what I'm gonna do with them yet, but so cute. I just, I just really love Target, so I'm gonna put those in the description for you guys because they are cutie tooties, aren't they? And the last package I'm gonna show you, just because this was fun for me, so I thought, okay, well, if it's fun for me, I guess I can show it to everybody. Oh, first I gotta start over here. I'm going to be doing a giveaway on my Instagram page, so if you're not following me, go follow me there, and I'm gonna tell you why. So you guys have seen these, not these ones, these cups and plates that I use for the kids, bowls, and they're just my little fave. And let me tell you, I loved these, and I got them off eBay. I loved them so much, that my mom had them because they're actually durable. And then I accidentally found this brand and it is the most durable plastic you've ever witnessed. I just love it so dang much. And I'm gonna be giving a full set of these away to like two or three people, I'm not really sure yet. So I got stocked up on a few other of their products items that I haven't used of this brand before. I'm gonna put their Amazon page in the description for you. So their sippy cups I've had, loved, and even now I still sometimes have my kids use these if I don't want to spill. But a new product that these guys came out with is, let me find it. So it's the same sippy cup on the bottom, but they have different, oh, these right here. They have lids with straws so Olivia won't feel like you know, 
she's drinking out of a sippy cup. So I think that they will really like those. And then I've never tried their utensils, but I, is it just me or do you lose your utensils like crazy? Just kid ones. Like I don't lose mine, but the kids utensils get lost so fast and it just makes me a crazy woman. I'm not exactly sure when the giveaway will go up, but come follow me on Instagram and I'll be doing a little giveaway. Why? Why does this make me so giddy? I don't know. What you doing with that uh uh? What you doing with that uh uh? All right, now that I've shared all my packages with you all, I think it's time for me to get dressed and out of my robe. What do you guys think? <laughs> Would that be a nice idea? I mean, maybe I should just stay in it all day. I don't really know. Feels good to be back to regular life. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.